Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, Force here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Overwatch menu options and settings that are going to be available in the beta. Now, it's very weird, I, I when I opened up my Battle.net client this morning, the game just started downloading, I couldn't believe it. Now, the servers aren't up yet, so we can't actually take a look at gameplay, as you can see here, it's going, no, we're not connected, blah 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 blah, but I know a lot of people are actually interested in the gameplay options, the keybinds, and the various settings, so let's just take a look at that here. Oh, while we can it's an option all right so we're starting off here with a mouse settings looks like you can set the sensitivity as well as invert look pretty basic stuff uh, you know you go lower sensitivity for better aim as like a sniper higher sensitivity for quicker spinning around gamepad is showing up as an option so I don't know if there's supposed to be gamepad support right away I thought there wasn't but I mean here it is gamepad horizontal sensitivity vertical and invert look as well um, this points towards possible future console release I, I don't know I don't know what else to say now here's a look at the keybinds this is what's important to us here as uh, PC players so movement WASD pretty simple crouch with left control jump with space or a oh my god the freaking <laughs> the freaking uh the, the binds are actually in here already for playing with a controller that's hilarious all right so uh weapons and abilities ability one two and three bound to left shift e and q we knew that also it looks like bumpers and y on the controller primary and secondary fire clearly those mouse buttons uh equip weapons so if you got multiple weapon choices like i know mercy for example has an offhand pistol you can swap between the two uh quick melee with v and all this looks like it can be rebound as you can see as I highlight over it, we can click on it and say, what do we want to switch it to? I'm going to keep it as V. Actually, no, why don't I switch it to... Wait, I don't know if it's something already. I'm going to try switching it to uh, this. Yeah, mouse 4. I like it uh, as mouse 4, actually, in a lot of games. Reload with R. Uh, swap between the weapons with mouse wheel as well. Uh, communication. I found this pretty interesting. So here's some some quick communicating uh, different things that you can sort of say on the fly. So there's acknowledge, uh, I guess, a command or if someone else says something. Uh, you can call for healing and buffs. You can say, uh, well, there's also these ones that are unbound here. An emote, group up, hello, help, uh, thanks. There is a checking of an ultimate status. Uh, you can communicate the men oh no open up the communication menu with C <laughs> I'm like you can communicate the menu to people uh, the social menu social channels with O and P there's a spray with T I actually am not sure what that is I'm sure someone in the comments will let me know though push to talk look like looks like it is automatically bound uh, I, I guess that's apostrophe I'll probably change that to something else uh, voice chat toggle mic mute with M and then whisper reply with backspace that's yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, spectate options. So um, we know there's going to be an esports focus here with this game. Uh, Blizzard already came out and said it, and it looks like we're going to be able to toggle spectate between the probably the different players, and then also possibly different cameras on the map. And you can see all the binds here for that. Yeah, all sorts of different spectating binds. And then miscellaneous binds, hero select with H. This is when you're in the um, just respawned period, like you just came back to life and you're able to swap your heroes. You can open up that menu with H, switch heroes anytime. Uh, scoreboard check with tab, show FPS with R. I thought R was real. Okay. Uh, hero select with H, it says that, that's repetitive. Show F Okay, this is really weird. They've got a bunch of repetitive stuff, but whatever. Okay, so those are key bindings. Let's take a look at video settings. Um, the borderless window is currently what I have it in. There's my graphics card. It's actually a little old at this point, but there you go. Uh, resolution, field of view you can change. That's cranked all the way up right now. I don't even know um, what the highest setting is. It doesn't show an actual number, but there it is. For an aspect ratio, of course, gamma adjusting, uh, full screen display, best match. Uh, you can enable V-Sync, triple buffering, limit to 30 FPS. <laughs> okay. Uh, show stats. And then there here's the graphic settings. So mine's uh, default was set to ultra. Looks like Epic is a higher available setting as well. I might try that, see how it chugs or not. And um, there all sorts of different options, render scale, fog, shot. I mean, you guys can read all this. Just all just play with these options if you're having uh, performance issues. Uh, a lot of times shadows is actually a good one to turn down if you want to uh, improve your performance. But anyway, lots and lots of different graphic settings here. Actually more than I expected. I thought they were gonna be fairly static, but uh, clearly that is not the case. Uh, so there it is, video settings, now sound settings. Uh, enable sound, yes. Game volume, voice chat volume. Probably gonna turn that down. I really don't want to hear. Wait, hey, go, hey, go for the objective. I don't really want to hear that blasting in my ear. Not too interested. Party voice chat, team voice chat, push to talk, and profanity filter enabled. Okay, well there you go. That's basically it. Um, you know, like once more. 
the game isn't available to play yet. The servers aren't up, but the game just started downloading when I opened up Battle.net. And I figured, hey, I'd like to show this to you guys because I know there are some people who are interested. So hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed checking out the settings. And I hope you have a fantastic afternoon. We are going to be streaming a bunch of Overwatch today. So uh, be sure to keep an eye out. I'm going to put up an announcement video once that streaming starts. I'll also be mentioning out on Twitter. Uh, I'm going to play the crap out of this game. I have no doubt about it. So you can expect a lot of coverage uh, from me going forward. Thanks a lot, guys. Hope you have a fantastic afternoon. I'll see you later.